Now is the time for morning and reflection. Robin Johansson has a word she would like to share. I feel so hollow. She was a loving friend to me, and I miss her. I want to share a piece of her with all of you. When my mother was sick, she was over helping our family weed the garden and put up some preserves. I remember saying to her, I don't know what I'll do without mom. She's like my best friend, always giving good advice about life and helping me steer clear of treacherous waters. She listened as we tediously pulled the weeds from the garden. After a moment of silence, she replied, A mother is the only person in the world who will always love you for who you are. Tell you the truth when others won't. She'll be closer than any friend because her life is all about making your life better. It doesn't matter how far apart you are, how much time has passed. Impressions will remain forever. I read once and I think it applies. He who will in private tell thee of thy faults is truly thy friend, for he endangers thy dislike and doth hazard thy hatred. There are very few in this world that will tell you the truth. Mothers always will, because they love you more than they love themselves. They care about your struggles They care about your fears. And through all the challenges, they won't abandon you. They would die for you. But more importantly, and more courageous, they will live for you. In her own way, she was reassuring me, giving me hope for the future. I asked her how she'd become so wise about mothers and where her mother was. I was told the doctor asked mother to choose during labor between her life and mine. She gave her life so I could live. When I was old enough, I vowed to pass it on to others, to cherish it every day, make her proud of what I'd become. This is how we honor them. I see a lot of your mom in you, and it makes me smile. This girl lived her life in service of others, a dedication of the life she'd been given. I will always remember her and try to live as she did. God bless you, my sweet friend. Is there anyone else who would like to share? The room was silent, save for the few that were emitting small animal-like sounds. There will be a graveside reading and a final prayer in about 20 minutes. Those of you who wish to attend may bring any items of interment to the casket at that time. God bless you all.